us right there and I'm gonna bring us right here and I want to ask what did you think about that singing what did you think about the sound of the vocal because I was working on this album while traveling and I brought this nice microphone and this amazing preamp but I was trying to go for this rougher more lo-fi sound and I thought instead of using this nice equipment maybe I'll just sing into the built-in microphone on my laptop and that's exactly what I did in the bedroom of my friend's dad's cottage where I'm staying right now two days before the album was released to the world if you haven't checked it out yet Links. If you're an avid viewer here, you know I've done this kind of thing a lot. I think there's an angle of it's not about having the best tools for the job, but the right tools for the job. I think there's also an even more important angle of you should just create with whatever you've got. And this album was really simple, you know? It's samples from old vinyl and tapes and YouTube. I did drums and keyboards in my laptop and there was one real instrument which was bass guitar on, I don't know, four or five of the tracks. And it's mostly an album of instrumental beats, but that one vocal you just heard, the only vocal on the album, I sang into my laptop's built-in microphone. I also wrote it the night before I sang it, just it was the last thing I did before falling asleep. I was lying right here on this bed, same place where I recorded it, and this beautiful poem just came out. And it deals with a lot of bigger things I've been feeling lately. I have these goals and dreams that I know are never gonna be a reality unless I work and unless I fight. And I've had more and more success towards those dreams in recent years, which I'm so grateful for. But along with that come distractions in the form of shiny things like money or prestige. And I know if those become the things that I start to chase, I'm not gonna be doing what I really care about. I've been right by water during a lot of this trip, and I thought of this metaphor about dreams and goals that I liked. A metaphor of deciding to stand on a pier and trying to see across to the other side of that body of water, instead of putting in the work to actually get across it. There are huge unknowns when you try to be deliberate about setting off on some new course, and I sometimes think of it as a kind of opaque membrane where maybe a bit of light and some vague shapes are coming through, but you can never really know the reality of those hopes and dreams until you pass through. I hope that wasn't too fluffy for you. Here are some concrete things about the new album though. The cover image is a macro shot of some grooves on a vinyl record. One of the tracks I started nine or 10 years ago, four of them were from about five years ago, and the rest I made this past week while traveling. I hope you'll check it out if you haven't already. All the links are in the description, and I'm gonna go keep hanging out with these awesome dudes in Sweden.